Hey guys, Peter here, and today, as you can see uh, from the title, we will be opening up some packs for the newest clan event in Vanguard Zero, and that is for uh, Mega Colony, right? So this clan event is titled Attack of the Mega Colony, and it introduces the clan Mega Colony to Vanguard Zero. So, uh, this Osamu, the Mega Colony player, right, who has a very funny way of saying attack. Uh, whenever he attacks uh, with a very high pitch like ending right uh, you guys will know what I mean when you fight him but anyways let's have a look at the gacha that's the uh, that's what we're focusing on for this video all right so gacha details let's have a look at the cards that are in uh, included in this set attack of the mega colony clan event set right so this is the main guy uh, evil armor general giraffa he's the right chain right the grade 3 uh, right chain for Mega Colony. So if you leap Mutant Giraffe, which is the great 2 is in your soul, it gets 1k and second effect is when his attack hits a Vanguard, can't bust 1, retire 2 rear guards and retire 2 of your opponent's great 1 or less rear guards. Alright, so Mega Colony, basically they focus on paralyzing the opponent's rear guards and paralyze means uh, preventing that unit from standing. Right. Uh, but in Vanguard Zero, Paralyze has actually got buffed in a way in that it also prevents the unit from moving up and down. And also, uh, I heard that certain st stand effects don't work on paralyzed units. Like for example, if you're playing Nova Grappler and you try to stand your units with, um, with effects, right, uh, they actually may not work. So I personally haven't tried it out. I'm not sure whether it's just a rumor or whether it's real. But uh, if that's the case, then actually Mega Colony will be a really great counter for re-standing re decks. Right. And also Mega Colony, uh, from the way I look at it, uh, can actually counter Aqua Force to an extent if Aqua Force cannot replace its um, restanding cards or rather the cards that enable fourth attack for example Diamantis and Basil because we can just paralyze them and then uh, the Aqua Force player will not be able to may not be able to hit their fourth damage their, uh, sorry not fourth damage their fourth attack uh, per turn so that's something really interesting about Mega Colony and I also really like the fact that that the paralyzed unit cannot move. So if your opponent somehow calls a grade 2 to the back row, they can't move it up the next turn if you paralyze it. Right. And I think the main thing about par paralysis right, is that you want to paralyze the back row units because in this game you need to attack intercepts. And what I'm thinking of is playing grade 2 vanillas and then paralyze your opponent's back row rear guards such that they don't get the boost. And so in order to kill a 10k rear guard intercepts, uh, they have to have 10k rear guard or 10k attackers or more uh, on their field which is getting common because of the archetypes that are, or rather the sub clans that are coming the 12k attackers but for now um, some decks actually don't don't really play that many 10k attackers so I guess it's sort of a valid strategy right and it's really fun and I think that's one of the uh, applications of paralysis right so basically paralysis just wants to make your opponent's units weaker the attack power go lower and uh, and sometimes even make it such that they cannot hit your they cannot hit basically because their power is too low all right anyways let's just get back right uh, on track so this is basically evil armor general giraffe it's a hefty cost it's two for two but if you have an abundance of cuts to call next turn the abundance of rear guards you can and you know that your opponent may not have that many great one or less regards the next turn you can uh, this skill can be very useful right and then the other one martial arts mutant master beetle this guy has been buffed quite a bit so in before he required three counter blasts to paralyze two opponents regards but now he only counter blasts one and he also doesn't have a penalty of minus 2000 if you do not have another mega colony card so that's good 11k base master beetle and rate let's have a look at the rate so um the double res will be machining stat beetle which is the boss for machinings and then elite mutant giraffe is the double res water gang the libra clone paralyzed madonna i'm not sure why there's so many c's at the back that's the perfect guard and yep let's just get started so i have let's see 15 packs so we'll just go 10 first and then five after that Alright, so this is my first 10 packs. I haven't opened any uh, Mega Colony packs as of now. So my first 10 packs, let's see what we get. Double rare? Oh no, stop that double rare. That's unfortunate. 
Okay, we got a water gang. Okay, let's see. Okay, Paralyzed Madonna. Death Water and Lion SP. Violent Vesper. Violent Vesper, I think, is basically Mega Colony's um, butt up car. So I can super call the top card to give you more fodder for um, Giraffa. So I don't think we'll be getting any Trooper Rest in this 10 packs, which is very sad. Okay, more Water Gangs. Come on, I want to pull the Great 2 right chain. Oh, they actually have machining, um, that machining card, which was a promo in real life. Yeah, I think we should have a playset of the Pest Professor. Okay. So not very good pulls in his first 10 packs. It's quite disappointing pulls. But it's fine. Alright, so just a lot of repeated double rares. So we did get 4 double rares, 2 water gang, kind of us to draw, two, draw a card. And uh, Paralyzed Madonna, not sure why there's so many C's again. But we already have 3. Uh, I think 1 is from the free one, the one that the game gave you, and then 2 is uh, the one that pulled. Okay, Death <coughs> Warden paralyzes the entire field, the entire rare guards of your opponent. Okay, nothing too spectacular there. Let's open up another 5. We'll continue more opening uh, in the next part, but let's just open this 5 first. Come on, a foil card please. Double rare only, okay. Oh no, not again. It's the same two double rares. A fourth Paralyzed Madonna already. And a third Water Gang. <coughs> Any more double rares? No more. Okay. That's fine. We're still early in the event. Oh my gosh. Fight the fifth Paralyzed Madonna. <laughs> okay, so that will be converted. Alright, so not fantastic pulls in 15 packs, quite disappointing, uh, but we'll come back and let's see, and we'll see what we get in the next part. Bye guys! Hey guys, Peyton here, and I'm back for more Mega Colony Clan event gacha opening. Alright, so I should have about 12 packs to open up today for this part of the video, so let's go. Clan event. So unfortunately, our previous 10 packs, I think, or 15 packs actually, didn't uh, pull. We didn't pull any triple rares from the previous 15 packs. So I'm hoping our luck uh, gets turned around. One only. Uh, it's not worth it. Let's just, let's just play the gacha. So we have 12 packs. Let's go. We'll just be open up 10, I guess. Okay, come on. Please. Triple rare. Let's go. No, double rare only. Okay. Why are we so unlucky this time round? <clears throat> huh? Triple rare. <laughs> okay, okay. At least we did get a triple rare. And it's oh, nice. It's uh, it's giraffe. Which is the right chain, the grade 3 right chain. That allows you to retire your opponent's grade 1 rear guards. Okay. <clears throat> I think Master Beetle is slightly better because it paralyzes 2 for just counter plus 1, but it's uh, locked to limit break. Oh, nice, and then we have Elite Mutant Giraffa, the grade 2 version of the right chain. And Machining Stack Beetle. The current machining boss and machinings will only get better uh, in in the future. Right. Really waiting for Spark Hercules. Okay, one last pack. Alright, so only one triple rare, but at least we did get a triple rare. And it's um, Eva Armor General Giraffa. So it's 11k base if you have a mutant giraffe in a soul. And when he hits attack, hits a Vanguard, Conobus 1, retire 2 rare guards, and he gets to retire 2 of opponents, great 1 or less rare guards. It's a skill that you really have to time well in order for it to be effective because you're retiring your own rearguards as well. 
Let's have a look. Uh, this is a free paralyze as long as it's a tech hit, which is very easy to accomplish in Vanguard Zero, without because this game doesn't have any guarding. And the machining stack beetle allows you to call two machinings from Solar's Rest and increase its power by at the end of the turn by the sum of the original power of the units called with this effect. So it's a free plus two. Mantis, tap the machining deck. This is the great one for the right chain. Can search your deck directly for an evil armor general Jarafa. This is a pretty decent card. As a finisher for the deck, I guess. So yep, that's it for these uh, 10 packs. We'll come back with more. See you guys in the next part. Alright guys, we're back. Okay, so I have 15 packs to open up for this segment. And let's just go for it. So currently the pools aren't looking too good. I only have one triple rare. After opening like 20 packs, 20 over packs. So let's just go for it. 10 first. And then we go for 5. Or should I save the 5 for the next part? Depends on this uh, 10 packs. Double rare? Triple rare, nice. Guaranteed triple rare. Let's go. Okay. Nothing here. SP Trooper. Oh! There we go, that's the Triple Rare. Um, Martial Arts Mutant Master Beetle. He has been buffed in this game. Instead of Color Blast 3, he Color Blasts 1 only to paralyze 2 of opponent's rare guards. Very fantastic. He's what everyone considers to be the strongest uh, boss for Mega Colony from this set. And I actually do think he's much better than Giraffa. Okay, that's just... I'm hoping he's not the only foil. Come on, please. <gasps> Is this... Yes. Another triple right eyes. Okay. And it's... Oh, wow. It's another Master Beetle. This is good. So two Master Beetles from 10 packs. I'm making up for the bad pulls. Okay. Water Gang. That's our fourth one. So we get the Emblem. Okay. Ooh. Oh no, that's a converted water gang. Come on, one more double rare. Okay, machining stack beetle. I'll take it. SP, um, that guy, the machining guy as well. Okay, so I think the pools are much better for this one compared to the previous 20 over packs. So we get two triple rares, and two of them are martial arts mutant master beetle. So we're halfway there for playset. Just look at the art, it's so cool. We have Sharp Nail Scorpio on the right. We have Bloody Hercules on the left. We have Gloom Flyman above. And then in the center of it all is Master Beetle. Okay, when it attacks the Vanguard, Common Bus 1 paralyzes 2 of opponents 3 guards. And paralyzes is just this. Okay. There we have our fourth Water Gang. That's converted. And then our second Machining Stack Beetle. Uh, to prepare for the machine deck. Let's see. First SP Armor Beetle. SP Karma Queen. SP Soldier. Okay, so it's not Trooper. Sorry, Trooper is the great tool. Yep. Alright, so we'll get back from... It. Alright, so I think I'm just going to go for 5 packs. 5 more packs. Why not? Please. Double rare? Triple rare. Oh, nice. Triple rare in five packs. is good. Okay. SP Millipede. I mean, it's all a bit weird because I currently have a running nose. Okay. Oh, wow. Our third Master Beetle. Oh. That's very good. <gasps> no way. No way. A shooting star in 5 packs. And 2 triple rares in 5 packs. And. Okay, so this is our second giraffe. Huh? For a second, there, I almost thought it was like our 4th Master Beetle. And completing a place of Master Beetle in 15 packs is insane. But it's, but it's okay as well, giraffe. Huh? Why not? Okay, and then we finish off with nothing. Lots of Master Frauds. But that's fine. Uh, five packs to get two Trooperas. I think that's pretty decent. Second Giraffa. 
for my Swahili title regards, your title for Polish Grammar and Less Regards. And our third Master Beetle. Very, very close to completing Master Beetle playset. Which is great. So I'm just going to have a look at what are the Mega Colony cards that we have so far. After opening about 30 over packs, 30 packs. Okay. Card. Uh, Mega Colony. Oops, that's Great Nature. Mega Colony, okay. So, this is what I have for now. I only have one of these. So, I do need more of that. Everything else should be a playset already. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just missing one more Master Beetle, two more Giraffas, two more Stack Beetles. That should be it. And three more Elite Mutants. But apart from that, everything should be a playset. Oh yeah, and two more Vespers. So we'll see you guys in the next video. And one more Tojo. Okay, bye guys. <coughs> okay guys, and welcome back to another segment of the opening of the... Okay guys, and welcome back to another segment of the Mega Colony pack opening. Clan event pack opening, gacha opening on Vanguard Zero. Right, so as you can see, I have 164 uh, of these challenge tickets here. I'm gonna go ahead and challenge Osamu. Okay, let's go. I think we, I think we can challenge him like uh, 20 times. So let's do a first 10. Okay, not good, not good. Please, gold. Okay, nice. Gold, more gold. Oh no. It's quite terrible. Yeah, it's quite terrible. Okay, it's two packs only. Roughly two packs or three packs from 10. Let's challenge him one more time. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Please. Oh no. Okay. Nice. Okay, it's better than the previous one. So four packs, four hundred beetles means four packs. Okay, so I think we should be able to open up about fifteen. Yeah. So almost eighteen. Uh, but I don't think I have any more. Okay, let's collect this. Yeah, that's about it. So uh, fifteen gachas. Let's just go for it. So right now I have three Master Beetles, missing one more for a playset. Uh, I still need the um, Elite Mutant Giraffa. It's pretty good fit too, which is a double rare. Giraffas I have two. Uh, Stat Beetles I think I need more as well. Two more I guess. And that's pretty much it for the set. So let's just go. First 10 packs. Okay. Triple rare. Nice. Alright. I'm okay with any of the triple rares. Okay. SP Phantom Black. Ooh, is it an SP Water game? It's nice because uh, it will not be converted. It's new, so I don't have it yet. Okay. Halfway there, halfway there. Ooh. Oh, okay, that's our third. Uh, Eva Armor General Giraffe. Right. Can I get another triple rare? If I can, that'd be amazing. Oh, I actually can. Okay, so this. I think I got a place of Giraffe already. But I prefer Master Beetle. <laughs> That's fine. Uh, it's a foil. I'll, I'll take it. A triple rare. Okay, that'll be a converter water gang. I already have four of And then a final five cuts. Six cuts, sorry. Okay, so that should be our playset of giraffes. 
that'll do for now I guess and then this is our new SP water gun looks pretty amazing very nice and everything is converted okay we still have five more packs let's just go for it okay just give me a foil at least one foil double rare okay only it stops that it stop the double rare SP Karma Queen. Oh, nice. That's the one I wanted. Elite Mutant Giraffe. That's my second one. Is that all? SP Hornet. Okay. SP Mosquito. Last five cards. Oh, no. Unfortunately, we only get one foil, but that's fine. Alright, so I'm back. So the previous part, uh, there was no commentary for it because uh, because something went wrong with the, uh, while I was recording, right? But I did manage to pull my fourth um, Master Beetle, so I actually have a playset of all the Triple Rares, which is basically just two, right? Master Beetle and Giraffa from this set. Right now, I'm just trying to get the Double Rares, which should be easier to get, I guess. Okay, so... Uh, this will be our final seven packs for the attack of the Mega Colony Clan event. Let's go for it. Final seven packs. Still missing quite a number of double rares, but I think it's fine already. The deck should be okay to work. Ooh, we actually get a triple rare in these seven packs. Okay. Actually, we have all the triple rares already, so it's just converted. I'm more interested in seeing the double rare, if you do get any double rares. Oh nice! I think that's our third or fourth Elite Mutant Giraffe. Which is good. The other double rare that I want is Machining Stag Beetle. Okay, halfway there. SP Beetles, Iron Cutters. Oh, okay. So basically with this, 7 packs, we got a play set of Giraffe. That's good. So the only double rare we are missing is um, machining step beetle. Yep. Okay, so the triple rare is in the last pack. Imagine if it's an SP triple rare, that would be great. Alright, so it's just a regular triple rare. Uh, Master beetle, which we already have four copies of. Alright, so it's converted. And yes, that's our playset of Elite Mutant Giraffas. So I think it's pretty worthwhile, uh, these 7 packs. Let's go back and see the whole Mega Colony collection, the Mega Colony haul for this clan event.
So I didn't manage to get everything, but I think I got almost everything. Just missing a couple of cards to complete a full playset. Okay, so we'll go to card. Then card overview. <coughs> Mega Colony here. Okay, so place out of everything. I'm glad we didn't pull any more Paralyzed Madonna. So a spicy water gang for the meat and giraffe. That's very nice. Yep, we do have everything if I'm not wrong. So four copies of Martial Arts Mutant Master Beetle for Ivama General Giraffa. This is the only one we which we only have two of Machining Stack Beetle. We can craft that, I think. Yeah, we have enough to craft two. So just nice. And then the rest are just okay. So uh just look at the foils. Yep, this is our complete set. It's not exactly complete, I can craft it. So uh once again, hope you guys enjoyed this Mega Colony haul thing. Mega Colony plan event. Plan event uh, opening. Right, of the gacha packs, so I hope to feature some Mega Colony fights on my channel as well, so do stay tuned for that. And with that said, thank you guys so much for watching, see you guys in the next video. Bye guys!